Hello, ABRF members. Welcome to the new ABRF online community, a web portal exclusively for members to support ongoing collaboration and resource sharing. This short video tour is designed to show you how to get started within the community. First, you'll navigate to the community landing page at abrf.connectedcommunity.org. In the upper right hand corner, you'll select sign in, where you'll be directed to the ABRF homepage to enter the same member credentials you use for the ABRF website. Once you enter your login and password, you can select, to, you can choose to stay logged in. You'll be redirected to the online community page. You'll only have to do this the first time you log in. Once you're in, you can click on Edit Profile to add more information, including your photo, your social media information, any biographical resources, or other details you'd like to share with other ABRF members. From the community homepage, you'll be able to select communities that are either based on committees, chapters, research groups, or other open forums that ABRF will include for members interested in technology areas such as genomics, imaging, and mass spectrometry, as well as core administration and other topics to be identified. You'll select from the community list, and you'll see the resources available within each community. Currently, the communities that are listed are those that are based on ABRF volunteer components, including committees and some research groups. Each community has four components, discussions, library, events, and the member directory for that community. Discussions are the heart of the online community, an opportunity for you to exchange ideas, suggestions, and questions with fellow ABRF members. All questions and responses are posted and stored here. They're completely searchable and you'll be able to review them at any time. You'll receive each of these messages directly in your email and you'll have the opportunity to, to receive those messages in real time or via a daily digest of the activities within your communities each evening. Libraries are rep online repositories where you can post or download documents, presentations, web links, videos, or other resources about your organization, your core, and where other members of the community can post information and resources as well. Each community will have an events, has an events tab where you can share information about recurring activities or upcoming meetings for your community. In addition, there's the directory of members for each community for you to easily contact and connect with other members within committees that you serve on or chapters that you may be a part of. Very soon, ABRF will roll out additional communities for technology interest areas, as well as a comprehensive all member community where you'll be able to share questions and ideas that'll be visible to non-members but non-members will not have the opportunity to post, comment, or share resources within the ABRF community. So what's next? Take a moment, sign in, explore, ask questions, post something in a community that you're a part of, give feedback, share ideas, upload a file, upload a document that you're familiar with or that you'd like comments on. This is a great way for you to leverage the power and resources of the ABRF community. If you have any questions or run into any difficulties, always reach out to us at abrf at abrf.org. We hope that this video introduction has been helpful and we look forward to seeing you online engaged in the new ABRF community. Thank you very much.